This video aims to give you a general overview of how to install the CSL router. To begin, configure the CSL router by connecting the antenna to the antenna port on the back of the router, marked Main. Next, power up the router using the power supply provided. You will not need to connect the antenna provided if you are only using wired broadband. This section is relevant if you are enabling 4G connectivity to the LAN via an Ethernet cable to your device, such as CCTV, electronic article surveillance, or access control, via port A or port B of the CSL router. Program your device with the IP details provided with the CSL router. For best results, ensure your signal strength LEDs are both illuminated green. This shows you have good mobile network signal strength. It is also acceptable to have the LEDs illuminate in the sequence of on then off. This shows you have moderate signal strength. You can also improve your mobile signal by adding CSL's high performance aerial for the CSL router. This can be purchased via CSL's M2M Connect portal. If you are using the CSL router with an existing wired broadband service, connect port A to your device. Then connect port B on the CSL router to your customer's broadband router. This section is relevant if you are enabling 4G connectivity. To connect your devices via Wi-Fi, you will require the CSL router Wi-Fi aerial pack. When ordered with Wi-Fi, this pack will be supplied along with the CSL router. Connect the Wi-Fi antenna to the Wi-Fi connectors located on the front of the router. To confirm you have successfully enabled Wi-Fi, the Wi-Fi LED on the router will illuminate green. This section is relevant if you require remote access to a device connected to your 4G router. To establish a connection to the IP address of the CSL router and allow end users to access the data of their connected device, you will need to download the AnyConnect client to your viewing device. This can be either a program for your desktop or a downloadable app for your phone or tablet. To log in, you will require a server address, username and password. These details are provided on your CSL AnyConnect setup instructions document, provided with your CSL router. Open the app and click Connections. Click Add VPN Connection. Give your connection a description and input your unique server address. Click Save and return to the home menu to turn on your CSL AnyConnect VPN. When you turn this on, you will be prompted to input your username and password. Once these details have been entered, you will be connected to your CSL AnyConnect VPN. Once connected to your AnyConnect VPN, you can run the viewing application and configure your device to connect to the IP address of the CSL router. Thanks for taking the time to review the CSL router installation process. CSL. Connected. Secure. Live.